for the people here, they're, they're Facebook buyers, they're buying native, but how would they create a membership? Like, how would they go about doing that? What's the framework around how someone could use what you do with Tribe to leverage all of your knowledge? Well, there's really three home run indicators for when you're looking at markets that you want to serve. Uh, one is, are you solving an ongoing problem? So what's an example of an ongoing problem? Uh, let's just say like losing weight is, a, is an ongoing problem. You don't go from being overweight to the perfect weight like that. You know, that's a, that's a problem. There's a process to solving that problem, but it takes time. And that's why a membership is a perfect fit for that. Another perfect example of a ongoing problem is like a dog that's wildly out of control. You don't go from an out of control dog to the perfect puppy like that. Like that's a problem that takes time to solve, which is why it's a perfect fit for a membership. So that's number one. Uh, are you solving an ongoing problem? Number two, you know, are you teaching people a new skill? So when I think about like, you know, uh, some of the markets you just mentioned, like ad buying, like you don't go from not knowing how to buy ads effectively to becoming like a great ad buyer like that. Like that is a journey to mastering that skill. And even when you've mastered it, there's always things that are happening in the marketplace to deepen that level of mastery. So sure. just like, you know, in a black belt in karate, you don't go from a white belt to a black belt like that. It takes time. There's a journey to it. And even when you become a black belt, you still, uh, there's levels to the mastery of that uh, material. And so if you're teaching people a new skill, that's another home run indicator. And right now, I will tell you, the markets are booming. Like in our communities, uh, memberships are booming because people are hungry to learn. Like there's never been more people online than right now. And there's never been more people spending more time online than right now. And in fact, there was a research study that was done out of the UK where they asked 2,000 people that had been quarantined. And they said, you know, what are you looking to do, you know, during this time? And of the respondents, 69% of them said that they were looking to use this time to learn a new skill, whether it be, okay. you know, coding, whether it be gardening, whether it be painting, whether it be a new instrument, a new language, whatever it is, they were looking to use it to improve themselves. They want to come out of this a better person than them when they went into it. That's number one. Number two is they said 57% of the people said that they were looking forward to using this time to pursue passions that they hadn't had time for before. And so we're seeing this represented in our tribe community where memberships are booming right now. The sales are tripling uh, in many cases because people are investing. They want to use this time to use those, uh, to learn those skills. So whether you are helping solve an ongoing problem, that's number one, or you're teaching people a new skill, that's number two. Those are home run indicators. The third home run indicator is when you are creating convenience for people, you're saving people time, you're making their lives easier. So what's a good example of that? Well, uh, there's a gentleman over in Australia, his name's Andrew Krauss. You got your market, your audience would appreciate this. His uh, membership specifically, it's the higher price membership, $350 a month. And he creates Facebook ad templates for real estate agents. And so a real estate agent, they don't want to become a Facebook ad expert. They just want to be able to use Facebook to be able to advertise their homes. They want to focus on selling their homes. And so what he does is he takes the thinking out of what to do and he creates these Facebook ad templates that are plug and play for those real estate agents. And they're more than willing to pay for the convenience of having that given to them so they don't have to think. And at the end of the day, the return on investment is a no brainer for them because if these ad templates help them sell one new home in the entire year, the whole membership is paid for itself. And so that's an example where he's giving them templates, saving them a ton of time. And there's many examples of this. Like we have many teachers in our marketplace that provide lesson plans for other teachers. And so what does that do? That's again, saving time for people because the teachers don't have to waste their evenings and weekends lesson planning. Instead, they just get these lesson plans and they can roll right into the classroom with those. Or there's another site called Teen Life Ministries from Paul Evans. And what he does is he provides youth ministers PowerPoint presentations so that the youth minister normally has a full-time job during the week and then they're scrambling on a Saturday to prepare a Sunday sermon. And so what he does is he gives them a PowerPoint presentation so they have it pretty much done. They just got to make a couple tweaks. It saves them time. So again, this is another, another example of a market where you're creating convenience. So if you are solving an ongoing problem, if you're teaching people a new skill, or there's an opportunity to create convenience for people, those are three home run indicators for a membership.